Every week, the experts at Superior Pools of Southwest Florida share the latest trends in outdoor living spaces, including custom designs, ideas, and innovations. Watch this inspiration and transformation come to life thanks to our expert opinions and tips, and improve your own outdoor paradise. This is Home Sweet Home, presented by Superior Pools. Well, Superior Pools has done it again with another one-of-a-kind backyard oasis, this time in Bradenton, Florida. Like many of our northern friends, Norm and Marcy chose the Sunshine State to retire and build the home they always wanted. They were so nervous about building a pool. Understandably, this was their first, and it almost didn't happen. But then they met Ben and John. Let's meet our happy pool owners. Hi, I'm Marcy. I'm Norm. Welcome to our lovely home and our new luxurious pool. And I'm very proud that we have this. We love living in Florida. It's paradise for us. We've been here about five years. We're from originally New York, if you can't tell from the accent, and came to Florida by way of New Jersey. And we met um, on J-Date and very happy for both of us. We just celebrated our ninth anniversary. Uh, we love living in Florida. Uh, we, 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 when we were looking for a house in Florida, we, we thought we were gonna be living on the East Coast because everybody from up north goes to the East Coast. And we went up and down the East Coast. We didn't find anything we liked. Someone said, well, why don't you go check out the West Coast? And we just can't believe how wonderful it is here. It's, it's a much more relaxed lifestyle and uh, we, we just love it. This is the first time we've ever owned a pool. And um, we actually built the house prior to moving down to Florida. And we were concerned that if we had built a pool when the house was built, that it might be, become neglected or might, somebody might, might you know, uh, vandalize it. So we deferred building the pool till we moved in, uh, which was in 2012. And then we, I, 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 we were studying all the different designs you could have. And we, we were, you know, Marcy wanted a, a, a classical Roman edge pool, um, but I wanted to have a sun shelf and a spa. And it's very difficult to, to put a sun shelf and a spa into a classical Roman edge pool. So we, we played around with different designs and it took us quite a while to figure that out. And so we put a lot of thought and uh, planning into it and uh, it, was, it, was, uh, it was worthwhile because we wound up with, with something that, you know, that we like. And we didn't want to just get something right away and then say afterwards, oh, we wish we would have done this or that. And, and there's none of that now because, you know, there's nothing that we, <laughs> there's nothing more I think that we could have done than what we did already. How we got to meet Norm was he emailed me first and wanted to work with me. And, uh, you know, I had to write back to him to say, listen, uh, I'm not a designer. I wish I was, but I'm not. I have to do a lot of the other things around here. So uh, I'm going to set you up with uh, Ben. And from that point, it was Ben and Norm back and forth and I was involved in most of it. When we met John and of course Ben, John says, we build pools as though they're our own. I will treat you as though this is my pool and I will take care of it. And even after it's done and they've lived up to their word over and over. And then we meet Ben and we have a lot of questions. Norm is very thorough. Norm actually learned the whole process of building a pool. Am I right? He researched it because he wanted to feel comfortable. Not to say I know better, but at least when someone is saying something, he has an understanding so that at least you can ask the right questions. And I found Ben to be extraordinarily patient and thorough and knowledgeable and work with us and tweaking and tweaking and just a really a magnificent person. When we met Ben and we met John, the comfort level was was almost instant. You know, John John would say, you know, I like having a contract, but you know, I, I like building, I'm gonna build a pool uh, and I can do it on, my, on a handshake because I trust people and, and people trust me. And that level of trust uh, bore out. We spent about uh, three years um, playing around with different designs, uh, trying to integrate different features. Uh, where do you put the spa? You know, uh, where do you put uh, 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 steps in the pool? 
And we finally had that uh, more or less worked out. We wanted, um, a, we wanted a spa, but we didn't want to have to walk around the pool to, to get to it. Uh, you know, it's such a long walk from, the, from one hand to the other. Uh, but nevertheless, we didn't want to have that, lo uh, that long walk. And we wanted a sun shelf that was going to really be large enough for grandkids to be enjoying because, you know, the, 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 the one-year-old and the two-year-old really can't be in a, in a swimming pool, certainly by themselves. So we had a lot. Of, we had this design more or less uh, laid out, and then when we came to um, to work with Ben, he ha he added some uh, some ideas. So when Norm first walked in, he had a plan laid out exactly. I mean, even dimensioned out exactly of where he wanted it on his house, which isn't typical of most of my clients. But what he had laid out was pretty much perfect for the space. Um, the way the house is shaped, with having the L shape. Most people would just put a small pool area in this section. Um, and that's also a very price point driven idea. With this, he opened up all this space out in front of here, which is really the most usable space on this back uh, backyard. He said, look, uh, you know, don't make, don't, don't, you don't need to make the pool so wide. But, you know, you can, you can, you can shrink this area. It won't, you know, it'll, 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 it'll save money. You don't have to have the, the deck. I had the deck much larger because I thought we needed it. Ben said, listen, you don't need it that large. We can save money by making it smaller. Uh, so Ben was uh, made some very valuable uh, suggestions, and Ben was the one who was able to figure out uh, how to how to design this the curved steps. We we had this idea for curved steps curving from, from uh, the Roman edge at one end into the shelf, which was kind of difficult to do. And I gave Ben a sketch and immediately he came back with exactly the right thing to do for the steps. Just a couple of points about the design and material choices and things like that. You know, when, when Marcy and Norm were really on the fence about travertine, they know they liked the idea of the product because it is a natural stone and it's gonna last a long time and it's gorgeous when you get good stone, we kind of got them over the hump of being worried about having bad stone and that we were, we were gonna take care of it and we wouldn't leave a deck looking that way. Travertine is a natural stone and if you buy it, you're, you know, there's no guarantee of the results of what the shipment will be. And other pool companies would say, you can order travertine, but just realize we can't guarantee what it would look like. John at Superior was the first person that said, we will take on the responsibility that it's right. So many people think it's a tile, it's gonna look like a floor tile, and it's not. So I said, Norm, you're going with us, you're spending the money. So when it's a bad stone, a year down the road, two years down the road, if you don't like it, I'll send the guys up there as many times as I need to to make you happy. And knowing Norm, he wanted the extra step above that, so I said, listen, you can go to the travertine yard and pick out every single brick that you want. And that's what he did. That was what sealed the travertine deal, no, <laughs> no pun intended. But um, everybody else, it was, it, was a, it was a gamble. And it's an expensive gamble with 2,500 square foot of deck. And we were so nervous about that. And when John put us at ease, he said, don't worry about it. it I will make it right. It's not gonna cost you more. And, and that, was, that was unique. You know, Norm is uh, very picky and more like myself, so when I met him, I was like, you know, this might be a pain to build this pool, but it's gonna be awesome when it's done because if I can make Norm happy, I can make anyone happy. Making people happy seems to be a common thread among successful companies, and it helps when they team up with the right manufacturers. Stay tuned for more Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools. Superior Pools of Southwest Florida have been building pools in Florida since 2001 and have constructed over 5,000 pools. From Sarasota to Naples, we are recognized as a top pool builder and number one in customer service and have been voted to have the number one pool in the world the last two years. A pool signifies relaxation and our superior designs and execution will provide you with true luxury living. Visit our Fort Myers office, serving Lee to Collier counties, or our Port Charlotte office, serving Charlotte to Manatee counties. Join the rest, build with the best. Contact us to start building your dream pool today. Based on tile, 
Tampa Bay's largest selection of natural stone. Specializing in travertine and marble both for interior and exterior use, with over 20 million square feet of revolving stock, we're sure we have your project covered. Check out one of our exclusive products such as tiramisu. Travertine, your ideal pool deck material, does not retain heat. Therefore, it's cool on your feet during those hot Florida months. Durability? Remember, it will outlive us all. Check out our newly renovated showroom in Orlando or our brand new 100,000 square foot showroom and warehouse in Tampa. Enjoying the outdoors is what living in Florida is all about. And at Absolute Aluminum, we are in the business of making your outdoor living dreams a reality. We can transform your space into a stunning retreat with open view cages, adjustable pergolas, outdoor kitchens, and many other products. Everything we do is completely custom, maximizing your space to fit your project with our extensive design capabilities. Contact us today or visit our showroom located in Venice, Florida. Superior Pools of Southwest Florida have been building pools in Florida since 2001 and have constructed over 5,000 pools. From Sarasota to Naples, we are recognized as a top pool builder and number one in customer service and have been voted to have the number one pool in the world the last two years. A pool signifies relaxation and our superior designs and execution will provide you with true luxury living. Visit our Fort Myers office, serving Lee to Collier counties, or our Port Charlotte office, serving Charlotte to Manatee counties. Join the rest, build with the best. Contact us to start building your dream pool today. Sitting with Norm and Marcy and having his design and then, you know, just trying to pull it all together, we did do a little bit of tweaking and just mostly on the size and shape of things. And, and one thing that Norm was adamant about and was to make this spot bigger than normal. Um, and at the end of the day, when you look at it with the size of the pool and everything, it really, it really works. He's right, it should have been this size. and. Um, how big a raise is that? How big? How that's, tall? That's 18 inch raise. Um, and the whole idea of that is when you come over, you can sit down on the edge of the spa and you can swing your legs over to get in. Uh, and also by having it here with all this seating area, it's like, an, it's like a built in bench around here. Another thing with the spa, and I gotta tell you this, when Norm would meet with Ben in the office deciding how big should the spa you had a gr group of guys, Ben pulls other people in, and they're crouching down, trying to figure out how many grown men, you know, could sit in the spa. I mean, they actually, without, the, without their feet touching. without touching each other, because, you know, guys don't want to be on top of each other. But I'm saying they would, again, the attention to detail. Because they like the look of the travertine so much, we did what we call a split face travertine, which is the same as the stone on the deck, but it's a, it's a broken edge, so it gives you like a really rough natural look. And it's the exact same stone as what's on the deck, so it pulls it all together. Um, and then up to the, the coping that we put on the pool, this is called a Tirano, which is a vein cut travertine. So if you look at it, you can see the, the veins of the travertine. It's kind of like when you cut a tree. If you cut a tree this way, you see the rings, and you cut a tree this way, you see the veins running through it. We definitely went back and forth about how we were gonna do this spillway, whether it was gonna be one big spillway, whether we were gonna have one spillway in the center. Um, Norm's big point was he wanted the water falling and um, he liked the idea of the two spillways. So I drew it up a couple different ways, sent him different pictures in the 3D, um, and this is what we landed on. Now another good Norm story, because he is so particular, Norm went to a granite uh, supplier and picked out his own granite. Um, and we installed it, and that was that. That just worked out perfect because I didn't want to have that that issue uh, uh, come that up. Did, that did work <laughs> out perfect, but that was the only thing that we let Norm present into the pool. He had about 20 other things that he wanted <laughs> us to put in, and I, and I had to stop him a couple times. I said, Norm, I am the builder, you are the customer. Let me or let us do what we do. Now we're going to talk about this big uh, sun shelf. This thing is. To me, the centerpiece of the whole pool, 
It makes the spa from the spill to the pool. It's like having a kiddie pool in a pool itself. It's a big area here. Uh, and the whole idea was that they could have plenty of chairs in here, plenty of grandkids. And I think we really accomplished that. Something else we did on this was put another light up here because when you have big sun shelf areas like this, if you don't light it, it will be really shaded at night. Uh, so we put another light up on the sun shelf just to brighten this whole area up. And then uh, the stairs here too, coming off of the sun shelf, this was a big point that took us a lot of going back and forth. And because of the Roman, what, what we refer to as the Roman uh, shape of this pool, which has these like scalloped corners and these little uh, outs here. It was important to have the Roman edge and then have it match, if you will, other aspects of the pool. So if you notice, um, you know, you have the Roman edge design and then even the shelf, the way it curves and the steps, they all coordinate. Well, my idea was the me and, that Norm actually agreed with me on was you have the big sun shelf area, so you should have steps coming off of there. And then this area over here, you should have an entrance from over here too. So I swept the stairs around to get to this area so you got two entry points. And it turned out gorgeous, especially when you get a view coming this way. They just look like big, expansive stairs. It looks awesome. I just want to mention, even Ben, attention to detail, the steps. Ben said if you if you don't make the steps wide enough, you'll end up with this corner where dirt could collect. Now, we would never know that, but they're so attentive to detail. But one of the big main features here was that we did a, like a two-tone look, um, and that was to offset the Roman edge of the pool, uh, which was real important to them as well. Um, they wanted this nice shape, and so by doing a darker colored coping, it really sets off that shape. Um, something else that we do on our, on our travertine decks is where, you, where your decking meets your house, you have to have a drain. We call that a deco drain. Typically builders, we use them also on paver decks and concrete is a plastic drain that l runs along the house. But when you're going to travertine and paying the money you are for travertine, to us it should all just flow. So we make our deco drain out of travertine um, and then also the skimmer lid, which is typically a plastic piece on the pool, uh, we just throw away that plastic piece and cut out a piece of travertine to make your lid out of. All right, now we're gonna talk about this handrail. Uh, this is a new type of handrail, new style, very contemporary, elegant. It really makes the pool look uh, up to date. You know, the old handrails are more like a commercial style. And when it comes to handrails, Customers come in, they think every pool gets a handrail. That is not true. It is not code to have a handrail. So we try to tell them if you're in need of a handrail, let's do it after the fact. Let's have you be in your pool, be buoyant, walk up the steps, then we can come put it in afterwards. If it's a must, we'll put it in up front, but we always like to do it afterwards because if it was me, Ben designed this pool, but I probably would have stuck it over there by the steps. You know, now it's over here. It looks awesome. Stay tuned for more Home Sweet Home presented by Superior Pools. Superior Pools of Southwest Florida have been building pools in Florida since 2001 and have constructed over 5,000 pools. From Sarasota to Naples, we are recognized as a top pool builder and number one in customer service and have been voted to have the number one pool in the world the last two years. A pool signifies relaxation, and our superior designs and execution will provide you with true luxury living. Visit our Fort Myers office, serving Lee to Collier counties, or our Port Charlotte office, serving Charlotte to Manatee counties. Join the rest, build with the best. Contact us to start building your dream pool today. Based on tile, Tampa Bay's largest selection of natural stone. Specializing in travertine and marble both for interior and exterior use, with over 20 million square feet of revolving stock, we're sure we have your project covered. Check out one of our exclusive products such as tiramisu. Travertine, your ideal pool deck material, does not retain heat. Therefore, it's cool on your feet during those hot Florida months. Durability? Remember, it will outlive us all. Check out our newly renovated showroom in Orlando or our brand new 100,000 square foot showroom and warehouse in Tampa. 
Enjoying the outdoors is what living in Florida is all about. And at Absolute Aluminum, we're in the business of making your outdoor living dreams a reality. We can transform your space into a stunning retreat with open view cages, adjustable pergolas, outdoor kitchens, and many other products. Everything we do is completely custom, maximizing your space to fit your project with our extensive design capabilities. Contact us today or visit our showroom located in Venice, Florida. Along with Florida's sunshine charm come extra considerations when choosing outdoor furniture. And as you can probably guess, Norman Marcy spent time searching for the perfect place to find furniture that was well-built, comfortable, as well as beautiful. And considering this is the outdoor living area, which is so important uh, for us, you know, it's an extension of our home, but people in Florida spend a lot of time outdoors and that's why we built the pool. and having all this wonderful, attractive, comfortable furniture just enhances the outdoor space. It enhances our whole lifestyle. And, and one of the things that I particularly liked about it, uh, the construction, which is, is fairly unique, is it's actually an aluminum frame uh, covered with um, a synthetic um, uh, uh, material uh, that will not degrade. So uh, this is a good investment. This, is, this furniture is going to last a, a long while. There are many things to consider when building a pool. It can be overwhelming, but it looks like our first-time pool owners figured it out. Coming up, Norm and Marcy share all. So now we're going to go over the equipment. I know we've shown equipment a couple times. But we're going to go over each part of the equipment so you can have a better understanding on what a pool should get and what other pools do get. There is a big difference. A lot of people don't think there's a difference, but we're going to show you the difference. We use all Pentair equipment, um, and we try to use their highest of their line equipment that's available. All of our pools, we use the three horsepower variable speed pump. It's well oversized for most pools, um, and it's okay because you can ramp the RPMs of the pump down and you can run it like a smaller pump. It does a couple things for you. That's going to save you on electricity costs and that's going to save you on longevity of the equipment um, because you're not running it as hard. All of our pools are saltwater pools and that's your saltwater generator out here at your equipment. It's all plumbed in and what it does is in very layman's terms takes salt and turns it into chlorine. Now the biggest benefit of it is that it's a constant feed of chlorine anytime that your pump's running and it works off the output levels. Now with the heaters, we only use Aquacel heaters. It's a company based out of Tampa, local company, and they make the best heaters. Also, this is called a super quiet heater. So a lot of heaters, they're louder than your AC unit and you would not be able to hear me talk right now. In the summer, the pool naturally heats up to 87, 88 on its own. So it just tops it off and that cost me probably $10 a month just to do that. So going to that, to solar, solar you cannot control anything. When do you want your pool heated? In the winter. When you have uh, family members come down from up north, it's cold out, it's cloudy, you can't do anything. So the heater is the best way to go, and my opinion is electric's the best way to go. I'd advise people to, to think about what they want in the pool, what are they gonna use, what's important to them. And keep in mind, this is probably one of the, one of the few things in life that's really cast in concrete. And, and think about, give a serious consideration because if you think you want a spa, you've, you've got to build it at the time you build the pool, as well as any other features. And my piece of advice would be, if you're thinking about building a pool, call Ben at Superior Pools. What makes this all worthwhile is that you're so appreciative of everything that we've done all right we put in a lot of hours a lot of work but to see how you guys act about this pool and how thankful you are that makes you know the world a difference and makes us want to do it for everyone i think the process uh was, was very good i was very surprised uh to see how quickly it moved i mean to see it go from uh, a dig to steel to uh to the concrete in one week seem to be extraordinarily fast uh, when I look at what other people went through. We've heard people go for months before they got to that point. But i got to tell you something, John. We really found, when we spoke, first spoke to you, when you talked about, you know, 
making a deal on a handshake and doing the right thing. That was really important to us. And you're a man of your word. You, you've done exactly, you, you've acted exactly the way you said you would. And uh, we're very appreciative of that. And the pool is, a, I think, a tremendous success. We love it. Uh, and we're, we're so glad we, we found you guys. <laughs> but both of you, it's a pleasure to work with Ben. Uh, yes, has been. my guy, Ben. I ben is, ben is, can't uh, thank you enough. I hope you're paying Ben enough because he, <laughs> he has got such great um, patience to hear me with my questions <laughs> and then to come wow. back with the same questions because I didn't remember I asked him. Uh, he's, he, and he's, he's, a really, he's a really good hard worker and he's very skilled. Uh, we were yes. very lucky that we, you know, we, that we got Ben to work and, with. And the crew, it's all, I believe, a reflection of your Correct. standards. They come to the house, they, they're polite, they're hard working, they want to please, they're professional, they're competent, and the job gets done correctly. And it's something of which you can be proud and we are beyond thrilled with our luxurious pool that we've waited, you know, all this time for. But we <laughs> found the right builder. There was a reason we waited that we, that we found you. I used to be indoors all the time, and now I'm cleaning the spot, cleaning the pool, I'm sweeping the deck. And last night I power washed the cage. And I'm outdoors all the time. If you're interested in having a pool built by Superior Pools, please visit www.superiorpools.com. Home Sweet Home, presented by Superior Pools, would like to thank our sponsors. Superior Pools of Southwest Florida have been building pools in Florida since 2001 and have constructed over 5,000 pools. From Sarasota to Naples, we are recognized as a top pool builder and number one in customer service, and have been voted to have the number one pool in the world the last two years. A pool signifies relaxation, and our superior designs and execution will provide you with true luxury living. Visit our Fort Myers office, serving lead to Collier counties, or our Port Charlotte office, serving Charlotte to Manatee counties. Join the rest, build with the best. Contact us to start building your dream pool today. Baystone Tile, Tampa Bay's largest selection of natural stone. Specializing in travertine and marble, both for interior and exterior use, with over 20 million square feet of revolving stock, we're sure we have your project covered. Check out one of our exclusive products, such as tiramisu. Travertine, your ideal pool deck material, does not retain heat. Therefore, it's cool on your feet during those hot Florida months. Durability? Remember, it will outlive us all. Check out our newly renovated showroom in Orlando or our brand new 100,000 square foot showroom and warehouse in Tampa. Enjoying the outdoors is what living in Florida is all about. And at Absolute Aluminum, we're in the business of making your outdoor living dreams a reality. We can transform your space into a stunning retreat with open view cages, adjustable pergolas, outdoor kitchens, and many other products. Everything we do is completely custom, maximizing your space to fit your project with our extensive design capabilities. Contact us today or visit our showroom located in Venice, Florida.